Before I start reaction, I want to talk about the brand Journey Instruments that makes their own guitars and not just your regular guitars. They make travel guitars, which are collapsible and in some cases they even are made from carbon fiber, which is just very durable and withstands different weather conditions. Uh, I have one of those, but they sent me one of their new products and that is an electric foldable guitar. It looks cool, it sounds great. If you guys want a guitar or another instrument, buy them. Use the affiliate link in the description down below. It's just, it doesn't cost you any more, but it just helps me a little bit. It's just an awesome brand, which makes really quality products. And the newest guitar from them that I have is only $500, which is really not that much if you consider, uh, first of all, the convenience, the compactness, the sound and the looks from it, then it's really not that pricey. So use the link in the description down below if you want to buy something and let me know if you have ordered something. I really want to know what you guys' interests are uh, when it comes to travel gear and travel guitars because if you are a guitar player that likes to travel a lot, th that is just an amazing solution without any hustling of your full-sized guitar. That said guys, let's return to the reaction. <laughs> Third is live version, so that's why I suggest... Okay, so let's do the live version then. Okay. Love this song, but haven't heard this cover. I like the song from ACDC. Yeah. Okay, so let's check it out. It's the last one for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the live stream. Let's go. <laughs> Little percussion there. Me too, Maka. I had a lot of fun. It's cool that we <laughs> sometimes on guitar players uh, head of the guitar. Uh, most most of the times we just cut the end of the of the of the strings. Uh, but sometimes you have these guitar players that just don't cut them off, and that's what we see right here. It's not really um, clean looking, but I mean, it doesn't sound any different. <laughs> I would just say it's just would uh, hinder a bit of, 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 of playing or, or putting your guitar away whilst the strings are still so long at the end here. Making an arrangement for four guitars is not easy, but you have, of course you always have multiple positions in which you can play the same chords. Uh, you can play them uh, a bit lower or a bit higher, but have still the same chord. So I assume they use... Uh, a bit of that as well, but we hear a melody, we hear sometimes an extra uh, run or riff on the guitar, uh, more on the higher end. Let's continue. <laughs> on different pitches. And these are all steel string guitars acoustic ones. 
or I mean semi-acoustic perhaps. I don't see any mics, so I assume they are attached. We see on top of this uh, guitar, we see um, uh, some sort of pad where you can change the, the level, bass, treble and such, the volume uh, of the guitar. That's pretty similar to what I have on my acoustic guitar right here. Let me grab it once. That's similar uh, and we have a pad right here you can change different settings with him it's like more around this part of the guitar but it's 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 pretty similar that way uh, and then you can plug in the guitar like here to uh, an audio source with some kind of batteries it's not always the case but uh, there are a lot of guitars like that Let's continue. Ooh, that's fast. Okay. Like, on some of these guitars, like the first guy here and the last one here, we see some kind of uh, little box on the top of the head of, good, of their guitars. I'm going to check it and pause on another moment where it's more clear to see right here and this is I don't know for sure uh, what this is it could be but I'm not too sure it could be that it's just a little box where his plectrums uh, or his guitar picks are, are stored uh, it could also be uh, a device to, to tune his guitar or where he can see uh, the tuning of his guitar. I'm not too sure which one of it of them it is. I initially thought it was just for his guitar picks. I think it is. I'm not sure. Cool, super cool. Oh wait, it's not over. Now he's alone. A little strumming in there as well. That's a cool riff there. Oof. Hard to be this consistent. So what he does is like he um he plays very high on the arm of his guitar, but in between every note he plays the string uh, loose without pushing down so which is usually the E string the high E string he just plays the E in between every note that he presses so he plays he lets loose he plays he lets loose and every time he strums in between as well in between every note we hear this Okay, I thought it was over like a minute ago. Yes, nice one.